mem ama kupka kramanik umlu kiga maya mak mulilak apa jam kamgam amka nemnang ampa nemnang memua inok bomo gala apa yang nelama ini amka amga as it should be nane kari maraka amkam ja uklibik memarak neba kare hika Tell the captain that I'll be back on the bridge as soon as I've done his errand. Yes, sir. Good to have you aboard. I'm Lieutenant Silas, second in command of the Black Talon. We're your ride to Drom and Cass. I'm sure the ship will suffice. How long until we reach the planet? Shouldn't be more than a day. The Black Talon makes this run on a regular basis without much trouble. We're primarily a transport. I should also add on behalf of everyone, it's an honor to service the Sith and the Korriban Academy. Consider yourself our guest. You should consider yourself fortunate. Understood, my lord. I won't keep you further. When we arrive in the Dromen system, I'll have you informed. In the meantime, your droids in the conference room. We picked it up with the upgrades from Geonosis. When we docked here, it mentioned your name. With my droids waiting, then I should see what it wants. Feel free to bother the crew if you need anything else. I'll be on the bridge. And you, soldier, when you're done playing honor guard, get back to your post. This isn't a luxury yacht. Yes, sir. Identity confirmed. Good day. I'm Advanced Protocol Unit NRO2. My functions are diplomacy, translation, manslaughter, and calumniation. I have an urgent message for you from my master. Please stand by for delivery. You have my attention. This is Unit NRO2 to Grand Moff Kilrin. You are now in contact with a Black Talon. Well, sir, I am. And it seems you've brought me just the person I've been looking for. My name is Rikus Kilrun. I'm commander of the Fifth Fleet, second to the Minister of War, and my personal favorite, the so-called Butcher of Coruscant. You speak to the apprentice of Darth Barris. Explain this interruption. Six hours ago, the Republic engaged in an illegal border skirmish on the edges of Imperial territory. One enemy warship escaped. That warship, the Brentle Star, is carrying a passenger of vital strategic importance. Yours is the only vessel placed to intercept. This passenger the Brentle Star is carrying, who is it? The warship's passenger is codenamed the General. We don't know his identity, but the Republic believes he possesses military secrets, our military secrets. I trust the reports. The General must be captured or killed. Captain Orzik, the man commanding your transport doesn't share my enthusiasm. He's disobeyed my orders to attack. Feel free to show him what the Empire does to cowards. Then commandeer his ship, find the Brentle Star, and deal with the General. Right now, I'm more interested in getting to Drom and Cass. Oh, I can sympathize, but I'm sure I can convince Darth Barris to forgive a bit of tardiness. The General will be dead or in custody by day's end. If he's not, I assure you, your ship will never reach port. I will lead the way to the bridge. Once Captain Orsic is deposed and our hijacking is complete, we may proceed to the Brentall Star. Halt! My lord, this is a restricted area. Captain Orsic's command. You'll have to leave immediately. I suggest you back off before someone gets hurt. I'm afraid I can't do that. This is the command deck entry hatch. No one's allowed in until we reach our destination. Time is limited. We must proceed to the bridge immediately. Our orders were to treat any approach as an attack. You need to take your droid and move it. Your life is about to end. Blasters out! Attack! Attack! All Marines have been neutralized, scanning for additional threats. What's going on? Sir, stay calm, Ensign. Everyone stay calm. No threats found. The bridge is now secure. Who makes the decisions around here? I'm Captain Revenant Orzik. I'm pretty sure I know what this is about. For the record, I take complete responsibility for my actions. Captain Orzik, I'm told you disobeyed a direct order from Grand Moff Kilrun. Yes, I had no idea he'd respond this brutally. He must want the Brentle Star's passenger pretty badly. Maybe he just hates me. The Black Talon would be destroyed chasing a battleship. I've fought in the war before, and I'll fight again, but I don't do suicide missions. Suicide was deciding you could ignore your superiors. Oh. The captain's dead! The captain's dead! Shut up! You have our attention, my lord. 
What would you have us do? Let this be a lesson. Your only hope for survival is complete and utter loyalty. Yes, my lord. Yes, my lord. In accordance with Article 27A of the Imperial Code of Military Conduct, command of this vessel has been lawfully transferred. New orders are being downloaded to your consoles. Priority 1, intercept the Brenthal Star. Pekara, do as the droid says and prepare to jump to light speed. Emerging from hyperspace now. One Thranta class warship on the scanners. Powering up. Enemy is firing. Turbo lasers, missiles, and what looks like transport pods. I'm not sure. The pods are a distraction. Return fire. Aim for their power generators. So long as they're damaged, we're not. We have the advantage. Lieutenant. Captain Silas, sir. Engineering is reporting blaster fire. They just cut out. Continue the assault. I'll deal with this. I'll notify security. And don't worry. We won't let those Republic scum get away. Damage reports from all decks. We're holding together, sir, but I don't know for how long. Make sure it's long enough, Ensign. Your life and career are at stake. Please stand alert. Grand Moff Gilrand's representative has returned. Congratulations, my lord. Security reports that the sabotage droids have been destroyed. Bring me up to speed. Oh, please. Please don't kill us. Shut up, Ensign, or I'll kill you myself. We've penetrated the Brental Star's outer defences. Their next assault won't come until we enter fighter range. Another minute, maybe two. Transmission coming in. Long range. It's a message, but it's not from the Brental Star. I don't appreciate dramatic pauses. I'll patch the message through immediately. This is Jedi Grand Master Satil Shan hailing unidentified Imperial vessel. I'm en route to your location with 16 Republic vessels. I'm asking you to retreat before more lives are lost. Your pleading is pointless, Jedi. I am Sith, and there is nothing you can do to stop me. I've heard those same words from others of your kind. They are never true. The Brintal Star is under my protection. Our convoy was ambushed and I sent the Star ahead. We will reunite. I just crippled three Imperial Dreadnoughts. I don't wish to destroy you. The peace between Republic and Empire is fragile enough already. What about the stolen secrets aboard the Brental Star? Is the General upholding the peace? The General can speak for himself, but I believe he does work for peace. Incidents like this are happening across the galaxy, but only because we let them. Leave the Brental Star to me. If you don't, then may the Force be with you. Because the men and women aboard that ship can hold you off until we arrive, and you will be defeated. You're deluding yourself. The ship is already mine. You've made yourself clear. But I suggest you prepare to face a Jedi. And you may want to consider what that means. Entering fighter range. The Brentel Star is launching its first squadron. All right. Now we're close enough to fly in and send a raiding party. I assume you're going. Whatever's necessary to finish this. Before you go, you should know something. Most of the Marines will back you up. But we had to execute a few for refusing to fight. They were terrified after what happened to the captain. They panicked. They're dead now, anyway. We did retrieve their equipment. It's yours. We're doing our very best to serve you, I swear. You've done well, so far. Continue, and all will end well. Ignore him. I'll make sure he doesn't trouble you in the future. I advise that you proceed to the shuttle bay. The flight to the Brentall Star may be hazardous, but Grand Moff Kilran has complete faith in your abilities. This is Protocol Unit NRO2. I hope you're receiving this message clearly, and that your flight was free of incident. Please hold for Security Coordinator Ensign Brukhara. The Marines are on their way. They'll follow you in and hold each junction you secure. Try not to take too long. We're not a military ship. What you have is all you're getting. Consider me warned. I have been scanning the Brenton Star's communications, and security forces appear to be moving to protect the escape pods. It is extremely likely that the crew is attempting to evacuate the General. You must retrieve or eliminate him before he escapes. We'll have the General before the crew knows what's happening. Excellent news. I will be in contact if the situation changes. 
Proceed to assault all defense points between you and the target. The escape pods aren't far now. You can make it on your own, General. And what about you? I will face my destiny. Go now, my friend. Halt where you are. I am Yadira Ban, Padawan of the Jedi Order. I was sent to protect the General, and you will not pass. Isn't Padawan just another word for apprentice? You're not even a real Jedi. I will be. I've assembled my lightsaber. My final trial is to face a Sith in combat. But I intend to drive you back, meter by meter if need be. Just as the Republic pushed the Sith Empire into the dark of the galaxy. You cannot scare me. I don't need to scare you, only defeat you, and that I can do. You can put aside your weapons. I won't try to run. Besides, I doubt I'd make it to an escape pod without my intestines spilling out. I take it you're the general. Grand Moff Kildren sent me to find you. Kildren did? Of course. He would have the gall to send a transport to take on a warship and succeed. I was a general in the Imperial Military Service. Did they tell you that when they sent you here? Did they even know? You were a servant of the Sith Empire. You should have been honored to obey. If you knew what I knew, you'd understand. If you'd heard what both sides are plotting, you wouldn't be eager to restart this war. They're building doomsday weapons, shields that envelop planets, Missiles that darken suns. Republic and Empire are planning to raise worlds. Annihilate civilizations. It will be unlike anything the galaxy's seen since the great hyperspace war. Then it's too late to stop it. The so-called peace is already lost. If that's true, then why defect to the Republic? There's no place for me in the Empire anymore. I thought my last act might be to even the odds, create a stalemate. It doesn't seem to matter anymore. Oh, you have me then? Me, my stomach full of blood, and my implant full of cybernetic secrets and stolen plans. <laughs> what will you do? I'm going to bring you to my ship. From there, you'll be transported to Dromund Kass and taken into Imperial custody. Where I'll be tortured or executed, or at best, placed in a cell for the rest of my life. Still, there's nowhere in the galaxy where I could truly hide. I will follow you. This is Protocol Unit NRO2. If you are receiving this message, I urge you to return to the Black Talon as quickly as possible. Explain yourself. What's going on? There has been an incident aboard the bridge. Your tactics have inspired... Idiots! Now get us all damn well killed! Welcome back. I am pleased to see that you have returned whole. I do apologize for the condition of the bridge. As I'd intended to explain earlier, there was an incident. There are corpses all over the floor. This is what you call an incident. Several of the crew were extremely agitated by your behavior. Ensign Hedder feared you might execute anyone who failed to contribute to the mission. A group of officers attempted to free the ship before you returned. Lieutenant Silas objected, and a firefight broke out. There was a large number of casualties, but don't worry. I am fully capable of piloting the ship back to Drummond Kars. You're telling me they panicked and killed one another? That is correct. It was unexpected. Grand Moff Kilrin is eagerly awaiting your report. Shall I put him through? Go ahead. There's no sense waiting. Opening channel now. Well, how fortunate I could reach my friends aboard the Black Talon. The droid's been keeping me appraised of your work, but I've very much wanted to hear from you. How did the attack go? The Brentel Star has been disabled and the General captured. He'll be in your hands soon. 
Excellent. I'll let Corriban and Imperial Intelligence fight over him. You should be proud. This is only one of the many operations we're conducting across the galaxy. It's a new beginning to the war. The General was one of the greatest weapons the Republic had. A defector. And you've snatched him from enemy hands. I'll remember this. And I'll make sure you're rewarded. It is an honor to strike a blow against our enemies. You'll strike many more in the future, I'm certain. Darth Barris will be pleased. But my words hardly matter. Soon you'll be joining us on the home world, and you can see for yourself what you've been fighting for. It should be inspiring. Enjoy the rest of your journey. Kilrun out. <laughs>